Hi there. So in this video, we are going to discuss functions in C sharp. So first thing, open Visual Studio, then create one C sharp console project. Now here in this solution, I want you to first start with, let's say, keyword as void because in first example, I don't want any return type for our function then type in hello and then bracket okay so we got our first function hello which is not returning anything just printing out with console right line as message hello devnami okay now in order for this method to access from our main method we have to declare it as static you can also use public keyword but we will take a look at these two later now here from static void main we have to initialize this hello method so that it will be accessible when we run the code then console.read so as to pause our console output okay so when we declare this and run program it will make a call to this hello method and hello devnami will be printed on console now let's start now as you can see we have our output hello devnami so the call for the function is made from our main method if we comment this out then nothing will appear on screen so every <laughs> function or class needs to be initiated from within this main method okay so next thing is we are going to create one function that has a return type and also accept the parameters so let's say I want to create one method that returns addition of two numbers so integer value will be okay so Let's type in integer and then add and here integer x, integer y as these two parameters. Now I want to access this method from main method. So I will use static and also use public. Okay, now here I want to create another variable, name it result and do addition of x and y and then return this variable which contains addition of x and y now let me remove the earlier function and here I'm going to call for add and then pass on 5 and 10 as numbers okay and then we call for console dot right line okay then we will simply enclose our add method within a right line so as to output this result through it okay so let's execute this and as you can see is it is doing the addition of 5 and 10 and return it on console so you get the idea of how to create a function without any return type and also create a function with return type and parameters.